Hi, I'm Dave. Um, no one said that life was going to be easy, but we kind of have to make the best of the hand we've been dealt. Um, you know, there's, most of you know there's 613 mitzvot in the Torah, and it's impossible for, for all of us to keep all of them. It's physically impossible. Um, but I think we all need to make sure that we're, we're good people and uh, contribute to the world in the best way that we can. We may not be able to have the perfect family, get married to, to, um, to someone of the opposite sex and have children, but there's still a lot we can contribute to the world anyway. Uh, I think I realised that I was gay when I was quite young, probably about 11 or 12. Um, I told my friends at school when I was a little bit older, probably 13 or 14, and then I came out to my parents when I was in sixth form. Um, I was from quite a traditional family and I went to a Jewish school and although this wasn't that hard, it still took me a lot of courage and a lot of, a lot of time and effort to, to build up to that stage. Um, when I was at school, it still wasn't really spoken about. Um, I mean, we were still living through the, through the end of Section 28 and stuff and being, being gay wasn't, wasn't really an option or, or in the open forum at school. Um, I think I first realised that you could be um, Jewish and lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender when I went to Queer Shabbaton in Amsterdam where I met with people from all over the world who identified with, with these qualities um, and it was then I realised that you can really live happily with both the LGBT and Jewish facets of your identity. I think also a lot has changed in, in recent times. Um, the world is definitely getting better and, and more accepting I think particularly in, in England now, we've got groups such as Keshet UK, Gay Jews in London, Jewish Gay and Lesbian Group, um, there's even the Gay and Lesbian Orthodox Network, there's Imaot for Avot, Gay Jewish Parents, and there's really so much on offer to allow people who identify as Jewish and LGBT to live happy lives. I think that's kind of why I've got involved with Gay Jews in London and Keshet UK in particular. I mean, thankfully now I'm quite comfortable with who I am, but there's some people out there, maybe kind of you who are watching, that uh, have not really realised that you can be happy with yourself and marry these two facets of your identity. But there really are other people out there that, that are like you. Just really stick with it and, and things will be okay. You know, a very good friend of mine once said to me that, um, love me for who I am, not the person you want to be. And I think that once you're able to accept this, you realise that it gets better.